TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this fourth, the uh, this is Wednesday, the fourth of January. We're looking at the Dow up 30 at 33,165. It's trying to rally, but I, I'd say to subscribe to my opening call, let's let's be a little careful here. We've got a rectangle formation, and we can remain in this rectangle formation a little while longer. Maybe have to retest one more time. Maybe the 32,700. Don't have to, but that's kind of the way these patterns work. If you can stay in, in a narrow rectangle formation, it can last a lot longer than your patience. Looking at the S&P as a different pattern, actually quite a different pattern altogether. It's also got the cluster formation, but it's way underneath the 9 and the 14 period moving averages in the daily. The weekly chart is still quite negative, and it's up 13 at 38.38. It really needs to get to the 38, uh, I'd even say into the 39s within the next few days to say, now it's got the kind of strength that it should have had earlier and it didn't. Looking at the QQQ, and this is going to be very interesting because you've got stocks like a Tesla that's trying to rally in a couple of the ones that really have been beaten down. But overall, you're up 36 cents at 264.95 in the uh, QQQ. And uh, it's kind of struggling. Here again, you need 273 to say, ha, huh, now I've got some upside momentum. Haven't got that yet. IWM, that's the Russell 2000 small caps. Acting a little bit better, up at dollar eighty nine at one seventy six point twenty four. I'm watching this closely to see if, in this particular time frame, this is often where you find that the small caps early in uh, late December, early January, where the small caps can come alive. They haven't yet. We'll see if that does happen. Now this is going to be very important because gold is up again at a new recovery high, up seventeen at eighteen sixty three. This is kind of a breakout above all the resistance levels and that turns the whole area of 1863 right now it turns the whole area of um, let's call it 1840 to 1810 very good support looking at the dollar tried to rally couldn't rally the other day um, yesterday it did rally but today it's giving it back it's up uh, now it's down 58 cents at 10408 and the TLT this is something to monitor because the TLT is rallying and that's the TBT is the inversion. That means that yields are actually pulling back. That's going to be quite important. I'll be back in a few moments uh, for the Tiger Technicians Hour and check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. Dow is up 185 right now. <laughs> 